In a small college auditorium, the room buzzed with anticipation as the students awaited their guest speaker. Many were familiar with the name Mr. Samuel, a successful businessman, but today they were about to discover a side of him they never knew. As the spotlight fell on the stage, Mr. Samuel stepped forward and began to speak. I am Samuel, many people know me as a businessman. Today, I want to share my life story with all of you. Samuel's commanding voice echoed through the hall as he began recounting his childhood. I was once a very poor child. No book bag to carry to school, tired of facing the mockery from my friends. He paused, letting the weight of his words settle in the room before continuing. But one day, my grandfather shared a story with me. He said, a man without two hands wishes for hands. A man without two legs wishes for legs. A man who cannot speak wishes to speak. My son, you have all these things. You just need to put in the effort. Don't regret what you don't have. Strive for what you didn't get by appreciating what you have. Samuel's eyes connected with the eager faces in the audience, his words sinking in. I still follow my grandfather's advice today. I believe in it. You can do anything in this world. Let go of regrets. Focus on what you have, and you can achieve it. As Samuel concluded his speech, the room erupted in applause. His story had left a lasting impact on the students, inspiring them to look beyond their current challenges and strive for success. The message of resilience and gratitude echoed through the college, and students left the auditorium with a newfound determination to overcome their obstacles. Samuel's story had not just motivated them, it had sparked a flame of possibility in their hearts. And so, the college carried forward with renewed energy, propelled by the words of a man named Samuel, who had once been a poor child dreaming of a better life.